The fading light of a midwinter's day asks if we're prepared to be in the dark. What might be revealed when we scrub the scales from the layers of self? Tender new shoots of life in the woods accompany the first stirrings of the serpent sleeping beneath, shedding tears over what's been lost. Blackthorn begins to froth as we take action to plough, plant and grow deep ancestral roots. May blossom perfumes the static air as the tension between winter and summer finally breaks in favour of splendorous illumination. Reaching the heights of midsummer, a response is called forth. Do we own the skills of the warriors of old? Are we able to name that which is worthy and take a stand for her? Summer's end and our gaze returns from battlefield to home and hearth. Where is your home? What ground do you prepare for prayer? Day and night are equals once more, and something of a harmony is achieved, an unravelling of hard edges, an invitation to inclusion and flow. Promises of elevations are revoked as we slide down the meandering paths of existential turmoil and pay passage to a future irrevocably tied to the past.